Hallo und herzlich willkommen zu einer weiteren Folge The Wolf Among Us. Warum kam da gerade ein Polizist aus dem Hotel? Hm. Gute Frage. Ich hoffe, wir finden es heraus. Ladezeiten sind mal wieder richtig schön. So, hier stehen die Preise dran. Können wir die Treppe hochgehen? Keep your pants on, buddy. You have to check in first if you want a room. So come on, mosey on back and we'll get you set up. Why can't I go upstairs? What's going on up there? Oh, uh, you beauty. I work here, okay? I work the front desk. It's to help pay rent. Beauty. So, now you know. I know I should have told somebody, but Beast would lose his mind if you knew. Well, your secret's safe with me, all right? Let's not make a big thing of it. Thanks, Bigby. And thanks for covering for me last time, too. So, what are you doing here? Ein bisschen Spaß haben. Oh, you have a key. Someone else was murdered last night. I heard. The victim was someone who worked at the Pudding and Pie, Lily. She, uh, come around here ever? Oh, oh, yes, the, the troll. I did see her. So. I mean, you know, we never really spoke, but she came off a tad intimidating. Ever meet a girl named Faith? Or just maybe hear that name? I might have. I don't know. By the end of the night, it's it's kind of a blur with all the names. Tara, Brandy, Amber, Heather. Sorry. So. Have you seen Snow White down here? Or maybe somebody glamoured as her? You know, it's funny. I did see someone who I thought looked a lot like her, but she didn't say anything when she saw me, even though she knew that I saw her. I just assumed it wasn't snow and went about my business. I talked to Tweedledee earlier today. He mentioned you in passing. Do you know him or his brother? I took out a loan for back pay. It was like our third notice. And ever since then, those annoying freaks have been pestering me for the money, plus interest. Why take out a loan from those two? It was from the crooked man. Beauty. You don't know how desperate I was, Bigby. I had nowhere else to go. Look, if this ever happens again, come see me or Snow first, all right? I tried. Um... Thanks. Wait. It'll be better if anyone sees you that they at least see you with me, so they know that I didn't let you just wander around by yourself. Five minutes, please. We'll see, beauty. Just be ready to act like I'm trying to kick you out. That won't be hard. <laughs> Listen, Bigby, I assume you'll be filing some kind of an official report or something. Which is fine, it's just that I was wondering if I need to be in it. 
Do you have to mention my name? I mean, it's it's not like Beast would ever see your report. It's just... Don't worry about it. Who did us? Yes, I have to write <sighs> better. Thanks. I appreciate it. So we let's move Well, here we are. Which one was it? Two hundred seven. Platzen wir einfach mal da rein. You have keys to these rooms? I thought you had a key. Not to this one. Hold on, Bigby. I can't just let you go into any room you want. I mean, what if someone's in there? You can't just go barging in. I could just break in the door if you prefer. No, don't. I'll help you. Just don't break anything. Mach los. Hey, hey, what the fuck? Sorry. Jesus Christ, you're gonna get me fired. I need this job. Sorry about that. So, und jetzt geht's aber weiter in den Raum. In den Raum, der uns gesagt wurde. Schauen wir uns das Bett mal an. Mm. You get health inspectors through here very often? I don't know. What do you think? sure why they have desks in a place like this finding what you're looking for I wasn't expecting much in here but isn't this why you're here why you have the key no the key was just to be sure I found the right hotel this isn't the room Lily was using oh und up so are we done now no the room they met in was 206 und da gehen wir jetzt auch rein. Man hört nichts. Also 207. Open this one. Well, that's weird. This key is supposed to open every room in the building, but it's not working. Beauty! Ah, shit. Beast? Big B? How could you do this to me? No. Oh, no. oh, let's get in a fight. How could you do this? We've been together through everything. I took care of you. I love... It's not what you think. Please. You're cheating on me? With him? No, no, Beast. Scheiße, ich weiß, wo das enden wird. That's all. I'll bet! I'm sure you help each other just great! I know what this place is! Relax, Beast. It's not what you think. Stop lying to me! <coughs> no, man. What the fuck is wrong with you? She euch die Augen, genauso wie bei mir. Listen to me! There's nothing going on! I'm not- <coughs> Hey! Master! I guess I finally see you for who you are! Stop! Stop it! You told me you hadn't seen her, you fucking liar! You've been sleeping with her this whole time! Listen to your wife. Just calm down and... Beast! What the fuck, that Hörner? Ah! Oh, mein Freund, ab geht's. What the hell do you think you're doing? You aren't even listening to me! <coughs> She's my wife, Bigby! <coughs> Ah, 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 Alter. 
Ich knüppel schon ah, wie so ein Geisteskranken. Und jetzt sind wir zum Wolf geworden. Mein Freund. Weil der hat doch schon gedrückt, du Pisser. In die Augen, Alter. Er hatte genug. Ernsthaft? Scheiße. Shit. What is it? Oh, oh my god. Don't touch anything. Is this is this Lily met her client here. Mr. Smith, whoever he is. And then must have happened right here. Jesus. Last night? Yeah. I was on shift last night. On shift? Beauty, what? I'm not a prostitute, you idiot. I work the front desk. Was anyone acting suspicious? Maybe moving a heavy piece of luggage, or... Uh, he got the body out of here somehow. Jesus Christ! No, no, I didn't see anything like that. It just seemed like a totally normal night. How is that? I think it was kind of normal night. There's so much blood. Go lock the front door. Keep people out of the hallway. I need you to be sure no one comes in here. This is a crime scene, okay? But just do what he says. I'll explain later, okay? Bigby, what kind of a person could do something like this? That's exactly what I'm about Please, to find out. Das versuchen wir noch herauszufinden. I can't believe this. It's a huff and puff. I thought you were the only one who smoked that crap brand. Apparently not. Beauty. What is that? It's a book about Snow White. Or about the Monday version of her story, anyway. The whole book is about her? Oh, it's of Deutsch. Es war einmal in einem großen Schloss, da wuchs die Tochter eines Prinzen, trotz einer eifersüchtigen Stiefmutter glücklich und zufrieden auf. Sie war sehr hübsch, mit blauen Augen und langem schwarzen Haar. Ihre Haut war zart und fein und so wurde sie Schneewittchen genannt. Jeder war ganz sicher, dass sie sehr schön werden würde, obwohl ihre Stiefmutter eine böse Frau war, war auch sie sehr schön. Und der Zauberspiegel sagte ihr dies jeden Tag, wann auch immer sie es aufforderte. Sie klopfte an. Schneewittchen streckte den Kopf zum Fenster raus und sprach, ich darf keinen Menschen einlassen. Die sieben Zwerge haben mir es verboten. Mir auch recht, antwortete die Bäuerin. Meine Äpfel will ich, scho will ich schon loswerden. Den einen will ich dir schenken. Nein, sprach Schneewittchen, ich darf nichts annehmen. Fürstest du dich vor Gift? Nun lag Schneewittchen lange Zeit in dem Sarg. This is the part where she's in a deep sleep, but they think she's dead. 
Darf ich weiterlesen? Dankeschön. Äh, nun lag Schneewittchen lange Zeit in dem Sarg und verweste nicht, sondern sah aus, als wenn sie schliefe. Denn es war noch so weiß, denn es war noch so weiß als Schnee, so rot als Blut und so schwarzhaarig wie Ebenholz. Es geschah aber, dass ein Königssohn in dem Wald geriet und zu den Zwergen auskam, da zu übernachten. Er sah auf dem Berg den Sarg und das schöne Schneewittchen darin und la las, was mit goldenem Buchstaben darauf geschrieben war. So. We shouldn't even be in here. For my arrival. Für meine Ankunft. Schauen wir mal aufs Klosett. Someone's been rough with this dress. It's torn. Oh no. She must have been wearing it. He killed her and then and then he took it back off. No, there's no blood on it. It must have been torn some other. Ja. Tat wohl jemand ein Märchenfetisch, aber ist wohl kein, äh, nicht verwunderlich in einem Märchen. This is the same dress as the one in the book about snow. I think Smith was dressing Lily up in it to recreate the snow from the book. You're right. It's the same dress. I guess he wanted to get the details right. God, role playing as a person who really exists, who we know. That's just weird. I'm not sure who to feel worse for. Yeah. Okay, no. I take that back. Einmal ums Bett herum. Wir schauen uns mal die Blüten an. Das sind die gleichen. Where did you get that? Lily had it in her hand. In case there was any doubt over who died here. Hmm. What? What are you thinking? Bigby! I'm wondering if this might be a ritual killing. The bed looks like an altar, the way it's been set up deliberately with the flowers all around it. Victim lying down, no apparent struggle. Looks like some kind of sacrifice. Yeah. Oh God, sacrifice? And he's sacrificing snow, basically. That poor girl. I can't imagine what it must have been like for her, lying there just waiting. Yeah. She couldn't have known. She probably just needed the money. She could have been anyone. Beast. Here. I mean, not exactly here, but just how does a person... We can't know the answer to that. Every situation is different. Yeah. Yeah. He must have been so scared. Tun wir mal die Kassette in den Kassettenrekorder. What the fuck? Bigby, this? I think I heard this music last night. It was playing pretty loudly for a while and then stopped in the middle. I didn't think twice about it at the time. I, I mean, you hear all kinds of things around here and I guess I've already gotten used to blocking them out. Could have covered up the sound of the murder. Mach die Scheiße aus, bitte. Do all the rooms have these same clocks with the built-in cassette player? I think so, yes. Okay. Mach die Mucke aus. Maybe she didn't see it coming. Is there anything else you can tell me about this night? Anything that sticks out in your mind? Sorry, no, it just seemed like every other night does. That's exactly what's bothering me. From now on, I'll just be down there imagining this. Yeah. How can I find out who rented this room? 
find whoever has the key, I'm pretty sure <coughs> it must be held long term. And we don't keep a register or anything. This place is intentionally kind of anonymous. Ja, ein Puff halt, ne? I'd better not find out you're hiding something from me about all this. What the hell is wrong with you? I'm not involved in this. Please just do whatever you need to do and let's get out of here. Bin ich auch für. Damn it, get it together, beauty. Be strong. So, ich habe jetzt glaube ich alles gesehen, oder? Da ist ein Apfel. What the fuck? Do you smell something? No. Just apple. Oh no, there's more? What? What now? It's Richtig. Like in Snow Story. Oh no, do you think it was poisoned? It wasn't. I'd have smelled that. I think it's just a prop. It's here because they were acting out the scene in the book. Of course. That makes perfect sense. He's just acting out another part of the book. God, I'm just having trouble processing all of this. This guy has some kind of weird snow obsession, but then there's this other stuff too. The whole ritual sacrifice thing. I'm not sure what to do with. Hmm. I hope you're just about through. I don't really want to stay in here any longer. Okay. Hey, da liegt doch was. Aber das seht ihr erst in der nächsten Folge. Ich hoffe, wir sehen uns in der nächsten Folge. Haut da rein. Bis.